How's it going everyone? The man, the bomb, Lazaron here with another build division guide video. This time it's for an amazing, psychotic, crazy, sticky bomb build. I used the marriage chess piece and invented the backpack with this. It's extremely fun, extremely squishy, so you have to be careful. But like I said, very, very fun. So let's get to it. Here, we've got Barrett's chest piece. Skill haste health always for skill skill power based builds. And I've got a roll of skill two for electronics. Next we've got the mask, which is a tactician's authority mask with skill power rolls and electronics as well. Shortbow championship pads rolled onto the onto electronics and health to have the extra health because yes, the health is important. Inventive backpack. You want to get that sticky bomb out while you're at full health to take full advantage of that extra um, skill power. This is the highest skill power that I can get in keeping with the particular pieces of gear that I have. And also I have health rolls because I like to have that little bit of extra health. Tactician's Authority Gloves. I use the shotgun, but I also use the house. It's either or. So I've been switching back and forth with the damage, but you want skill haste though as well. Crit hit chance, of course. And then skill haste, of course, on the Tactician's Authority holster. So, we're utilizing the three-piece Tactician's Authority, which gives us the skill haste and the skill power. That's really what we're going for. The 10% skill power from Barrett's, the 15% skill power from Inventive. Now, here's what you do. When you funnel people in, or you take advantage of them being in a group, throw the grenade first it'll almost instantly blow up you shoot the sticky right where you throw the grenade and it's a double explosion which will if not down them it'll put them low enough to you, you could just burst them down but in most cases it downs them especially in the middle of a firefight this build is not meant to be solo at all guys it's not a solo build just letting you guys know right now it's meant for team play what's what this build really excels at is in the middle of a firefight, if uh, people are focusing your teammates and they're not paying attention to you, you could go in for that huge burst of damage, most likely get one or two people down, possibly. So yes, this build is more like behind the scenes, but it, you can consider it a support build because you're constantly staggering them from these explosions. So the mods. Every single mod I have is 265 electronics with 3% skill haste. Now the weapons, it doesn't really matter too much. I've been experimenting with the Marine Super 90 because it has talented and competent on it. And, you know, I do not like to rely on talented, but it's there. But I tried to make a build that did not rely on talented in order for the sticky bomb to have one shot potential. That's why I run the short bow championship pads for the instant grenade explosion for the double explosion really quick. It's definitely very, very, very potent. Also, the performance mods all, of course, 4% sticky bomb damage on every one of them. So, we'll go to the skills. I don't have my skills equipped because I had a different build out, but I'll place them accordingly. So, normally... You'll have the overdose and of course your sticky bomb. BFB sticky bomb. And then special ability, it's up to you. I just run with the green because I get it back so quick and I can bring teammates up. And now the talents, which are very important. Triage, because you're giving them an overheal from your heal, that procs. As long as you're giving an overheal or a heal in general, your triage procs. So Triage will give you your sticky bomb back quickly. Critical save, that's meta. Combat medic, I was running with a squad. This this build always runs with squad, so combat medic is a, ne is a necessity with this build. And then, of course, chain reaction, you get multiple people in the explosion. Boom. They all take a bunch of damage. So yes, like I said, this build's not a solo build, guys. It's mainly for group play. You're, you're going to be behind the scenes. You're going to take advantage of people shooting at your teammates. 
you're going to go for that huge explosive burst damage all at once. Which you can do with the sticky bomb and the grenade, both at the same time. So we'll get to some psychotic gameplay footage where I'll show you guys the inner machinations of my mind. You guys have a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.